if you are vaping, if you are smoking black and mild, if you are smoking cigars, if you're smoking hookah, if you're smoking cigarettes, if you're smoking crack, anything, just stop. Because honestly, it felt like I was going to die the other day. That's them smoking commercials where people have to put things by their throat just to talk. That shit is real. Like, I quit smoking. But guess what? I ain't quitting drinking. I'm saying. By the way, this is the best Arizona. I don't give a fuck. You can fight me down in the comment section. I don't care. This is the best Arizona there is, bitch. Fuck that watermelon shit. Fuck that food punch shit. Fuck that iced tea, that green tea. All that shit, like. Comment down below what days would y'all like me to post. And I'm only going to post two days out of the week. So choose which day. what's up guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is chanel nice to meet you like what's good today as y'all can see my title we're gonna do a seafood boil all right so i never ate from this place before and i really pray to let me pray right now before we get into everything don't mind my hair i just came back from an interview we're doing a seafood boil today and i really hope that this place is called I know it's somewhere. I'm just leaving down in the description box. Um, I'm eating on the floor because you know seafood is. It smells disgusting. Okay, wait, 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 wait. So I just made a TikTok, so y'all go follow me on there too. Like, period. Let me roll the sleeves up. It smells nasty. Like what it's like, you know. And I'm eating on this fucking. <laughs> pillowcase i don't care and i got a plastic bag and i got you know i thought i had picked shrimp to go in my boil but i fucking did it so the only thing that's in this bitch is crabs um sausage egg and potato and corn that's the only thing that's in this bitch. honestly i might not use the glove okay period this looks actually Y'all, don't bust this bag, bitch. So this would look like, I didn't want a lot of crabs, so I only got one. And the rest of this is just like corn potatoes. Oh my God, egg, mm. Now this corn? Mm. I wish y'all could see my food, but bitch. Mm. Yes. Did y'all watch my birthday vlog? I have fun with my birthday. I always have fun when I'm with my cousin. So, but I wanted to talk to y'all about smoking. If you smoke, then you need to look at this video and listen to me. Comment down below what you smoke. Because I might be talking about weed or like vaping. And y'all probably talking about smoking crack or some shit once you're done with that i'm about to tell y'all a little you know story so basically i got into this habit probably like last year in july um let me just say this i've been smoking for four years um but i got into this habit of smoking vape pens last year in july and i've been doing it ever since july july last year mind you before the vape pens i was smoking blacks like every other day but think about me i was a black smoker but i know people that can finish a black within one sitting me i would like it would take me like maybe two days to smoke one black like you know so i ain't really um oh look at that y'all oh look at that look at that uh you see i know you do the reason why i stopped is because that shit used to stink. 
if you if you ever smell a black and mild or a cigar, you know what I'm talking about. That shit stinks. That shit really stinks. Yeah. That shit turns your lip color a different color. Like your lips will be black. And that's because of all the tobacco and everything. Well basically let's take it back. I started smoking when I was 16 years old. I actually my first time ever trying to smoke, I was like in the eighth grade. I was 14. It was me, my cousin. Okay, boom. So I forgot to add this in here. But basically, it was me, my cousin, my friend, and him. <laughs> a friend from school. He was in a grade very younger than us. Um and he was he the one who introduced us to it. But when we tried it, we were smoking out a bomb. So I wasn't getting high. Like, I wasn't high. Because, bitch, I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. Like, I'm just like, I'm just like, hey, I'm smoking. We tried smoking out of a bomb for, like, only, like, a couple times. I said we did, like, at least four times, three times. I didn't get high at all, bitch. I was doing it wrong. We all hung out one more time. And we ain't never see that nigga again. He got shipped off to fucking Mexico because his dad found a bong in his book bag. And that was the last time I like, heard from him. And that was eighth grade year. And recently, like maybe like a year or two ago, I heard from him like... You know, we added each other on Snapchat, and I'm just like, oh my god, I miss you, like, because outside of the whole smoking shit, we was all generally friends, because my cousin was talking to him, so it was like, it already worked, because, you know, they fucking with each other, and then my friend and him and me, we all went to the same school, so it was just like, mm. but his dad shipped his ass off to a boarding school, and I ain't never see that nigga ever again ever again for some years bitch i tried smoking i tried how it felt to you know smoke when i was in the eighth grade but after that i didn't do it no more i literally tried them four times and then he got shipped off and then i never did it again i don't know about anybody else that was in you know i don't know about my cousin or you know my friend but i didn't do that shit again so i remember um, I was 16. I don't remember my first time ever getting high. I was just smoking from there, literally. And then the next year, I was smoking blacks. And then it wasn't, it turned to only smoking blacks after a Dutch to we're smoking blacks just because. Like, then it turned to, y'all remember Joel Penny? But, so I went from weed to blacks to vaping which is jewels. Then I went back to blacks because I was like, man, fuck this shit. Like, honestly, the reason why I stopped smoking jewels because y'all know how expensive them shit is, sixty dollars. And then I end up getting like um, really in trouble for in school because I was smoking that shit in school. So, <laughs> so like, I was just like, you know what? I'm tired of getting these shits broken up. I'm tired of getting these shits taken away. Like, I'm just going to go back to blacks. Like, you know, so I went back to black for a little bit. And then I tried, you know, the CBD pens. What's that shit called? The THC pen. But honestly, I only had that THC pen for like a month. And that shit was gone. And honestly, I liked it. But it kind of made me like cautious because I'm just like, I don't know what's inside this shit. Like, it's not like I see somebody in the lab working on my shit you know, waxing down the weed and putting it in my shit. Like, I'm just like, I can't smoke this shit. Plus this shit, $40, hell no. Like, I might as well go back to smoke weed. <laughs> and then this is where we get into the crazy shit. So basically, um, last year, I quit smoking blacks in July. And also y'all, I quit smoking weed in August. Like buying my own shit, blowing down, like I quit. I quit smoking weed. And um, not too long ago, I did try weed. Like, I smoked two puffs, and I was so high out of my mind. Like, my tolerance is not there anymore. Like, like, 
it was so bad like i was so high i was tweaking it felt like i was gonna die like so if i knew this corn was gonna be good like it I would have ordered extra. Okay, let's get back to the story. So, boom. One of the girls from my job that I used to work, that I used to work with, she was buying puff bars, just like jewels, but they're disposable. So I was like, oh my god, like I should try that shit. Like you know, I'm not smoking wax no more, and this is just like jewel, but it's cheaper. Bitch, I had my first pulled that shit and i was like yeah this is the one i think i'm gonna be doing this shit like so i started that shit in like july <clears throat> and i ain't stopped but here's where the real shit happened honestly my habit got so bad with them things to where i started buying three at a time and the only reason why i started buying three at a time two at a time is because it's a store by my crib and they sell them shits for like three for 20 and you would get three of those shits for 20 dollars honestly I, I knew i had a problem but i just didn't give a fuck about smoking them like i didn't give a fuck but the problem was when my chest started hurting i stopped smoking weed then stopped smoking blacks so i was only doing that shit but my chest started hurting the other day y'all I think it was like three days ago, two days ago. And um I was just like, I need to stop smoking. Like I can't. Okay, so it's been about a week since the last time I smoked the pins and honestly, my chest still hurts. Like really. Like it felt like I was about to have a heart attack. Like my chest it still hurts, but it don't hurt like how that night was a feeling. It felt like I was going into cardiac arrest, like like that was so horrible. It it is horrible. Like <laughs> I say that to say this: if you are vaping, if you are smoking black and milds, if you are smoking cigars, if you're smoking hookah, if you're smoking cigarettes, if you're smoking crack, anything, just stop. Because honestly, it felt like I was gonna die the other day. I ended up just throwing all of my vape pens away. Like the ones that I had just brought, you know, the three for 20. Threw all them shits, I threw them out the window. Them vaping commercials is serious. Them smoking commercials where people have to put things by their throat just to talk, that shit is real. Like, I quit smoking, but guess what? I ain't quitting drinking, I'm playing. I feel like everybody should just lay off. Just be sober. What happened to me the other night? It just made me think, just don't do it. Please don't do it. Because one of us goes in and then we all go through it. Just fuck it. Just don't smoke, y'all. By the way, this is the best Arizona. I don't give a fuck. You can fight me down in the comment section. I don't care. This is the best Arizona there is, bitch. Fuck that watermelon shit. Fuck that food punch shit. Fuck that iced tea, that green tea. All that shit, like. Comment down below. What days would y'all like me to post? And I'm only gonna post two days out of the week. So choose which day. Oh my God, this corn is so good. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, deuces.